Community members are demanding change in Lindale tonight after what they say has been a pattern of hate and racial bias in the school district as well as community at large. Our Sean Nelmaniz was at tonight's town hall where so many people voiced their outrage. Just behind me at Foundation Baptist Church in Lindale are dozens of parents and students in the Lindale School District who have joined a town hall to address racism in their district. Now you're about to hear from a community who says that they are tired. Parents in the Lindale School District say they needed a space to put everything on the table after a controversial photo surfaced online of a student kneeling on someone else's neck. This is why Joy Johnson, another parent in the district, organized this town hall. I thought, well, if not me, who else? One by one, attendees stepped up to the mic. The things that I saw was terrifying. I found out very quickly you get in trouble for the color of your skin. To share their experiences and also give advice to the district. Um, there's so many people that have, you know, experienced microaggressions of racism within the school system and within the community. And this is really an opportunity to give them a voice. So this is an opportunity for the school to say, you know what, um, let's work with you guys. What can we do? As people start filing out behind me here, the NAACP chapter in Tyler says that they're actually going to consolidate everyone's concerns and have a meeting about how to address them. We've got you covered, East Texas. Sean Delmanese, CBS 19. Lindell ISD did address the controversial photo by sending us a statement. It reads in part, quote, the incident in question did not happen at school or at a school sponsored event. There are several accusations about the actions of Lindell ISD that are simply untrue and are misleading the public about this incident. 